Yeah, yeah, there we go. You did it. Did you zoom in on this? No. Okay. I just feel like... <gasps> oh! Why would you honk the horn? <laughs> now I, those parents think I'm honking at them. I didn't think that one through. This kid needs to go I, to school I just planned right on, now for hurting. I was just planning on your, like, screaming. And it's like... Uh-oh. You did it. <laughs> I don't think this is working so well. Georgia. Freezing, didn't bring enough clothes. It's cold here. But I wanted to talk about why we let fear and doubt get in the way of us going after our dreams and goals. And I think when we think about a, a dream or goal that we have, subconsciously we start coming up with all the reasons of why we can't accomplish that. I'm free from living lies. Free from my own deception. Headed the right direction I walk through the fields of mud I thought I'd find So subconsciously we come up with reasons of why we can't achieve the dream or goal that we have that we've put in place. And the other thing is we make excuses. Um, for me a long time I couldn't edit or, or become an editor because I didn't have the ability to go to school to edit or have somebody teaching me how to edit. And I realized that I was making that excuse and that excuse was turning into my reason, which should never happen. Your excuses should never turn into the reasons of why you don't accomplish your dream or goal. So I never wanna let my excuses become the reason of why I don't chase a dream or goal. And dream seems like such a, a word that's a a big reach for us now. Everybody has these dreams, but nobody really believes that their dreams are going to be something that's achievable. Goals are something that everybody thinks are achievable. And Bo Bennett says, a dream becomes a goal when action is taken towards its achievement. Meaning, making that, that game plan, that plan of action of how I'm going to get to this dream that I have. And then once that plan of action is in place, now it becomes a goal. And a goal is something that everybody thinks is achievable. Last year I had a huge opportunity to, to film a documentary about Adam who was a huge New England Patriots fan that lived in Illinois. Jay Grask and Matt Light was flying him out from Illinois to the New England Patriots game, put him up in a box and making his dream come true of seeing the New England Patriots play from Gillette Stadium. And if I was to let that fear and doubt continue to win the mental battle because I've never shot a a documentary before, I would have never got to experience everything I got to experience of going out there and watching the game next to the owner's box, staying at Matt Light's house, going to Rob Gronkowski's house after the game, and it turned into this, this awesome experience for me, and then also seeing Adam light up the whole time of his dreams coming true of watching a game at Gillette Stadium. So fear and doubt is real. Don't let that stop you from chasing your dreams or goals. So I hope that you step outside your comfort zone a little bit like we are and start attacking some of your dreams and turn them into goals. If you like the video, please hit the thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, we'd appreciate it if you'd subscribe and hit the notification so you can see every time we post. So you should never let, ow, oh, that stinking hurt.